It's not Serratus, is it? That's them fucking laps, mate. Look at that, show me the other one. This is flared up, this one's nowhere near as bad. But... Nowhere near as bad? No, this, you couldn't have this. Okay, guys, so. I know you're all getting a bit sick of hearing this, but these guys out there are genuinely getting burnt. And in roofing today, they announced that uh, due to the timber industry's hard work and investigations, what a load of shit, my investigation, they're now going to put a QR code on the full pack of uh, of lat there, so you can chase the source of your timber if you, if you need. How many of us roofers actually get a full fucking pallet of lat on site? I don't know about you guys, but I just got the roofers merchant and buy myself a, a pack there and slap it on the van, take it to my site. Now, putting a QR code on the full pack of lot is absolutely shit. Shit! It needs to be on every single pack, not the full pallet. Uh, now, this stuff shouldn't even be getting into the country in the fucking first place. I mean, what is going on here? Timber industry, answer your customers, will you? What is going on here? You seen the state on that guy's hands at the beginning of the video? Absolutely fucking disgraceful, guys. That guy can't even work because he's, his hands are that bad. What is going on, guys? What is going on? I don't know what is going on. Somebody is making a lot, a lot of money here. They're making it out of us. How many of us have to die of skin cancer and other cancers due to these chemicals? Copper hydroxide, copper sulfide. Other chemicals, things I can't even pronounce. Chemicals that used to be in nerve gas. We used to throw this stuff at the Germans. God damn it. Why is it in our timber? Why is it in our timber? I strip proves off 400 year old. The timber's still there. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? I've got no idea. Somebody needs to answer us because uh, this has gone too far, guys. It's gone too far. Now, timber industry. I invite you to come and sit in a podcast with me. There you go. Throw my glove out. Somebody pick that glove up. Sit in a podcast with me and explain to me and the rest of the roofers here how this stuff is getting in the country, what you're going to do to stop it getting in the country. Explain to me why the men are getting burnt. Explain to me why these chemicals need to be in there in the first place. I mean, some of these chemicals, we threw them at the Germans during the war in the nerve gas. Why do they need to be in our timber? Why? Why are they all the roofers merchants out there not storing their product inside? Why are we getting stuff with uh, over 80% humidity in the timber when the humidity should be 20? Absolutely disgusting. Now, somebody from the timber industry, pick up my glove, sit in the podcast with me and explain what is going on, why these merchants aren't storing their products properly. I mean, the guidelines say the timber should be stored at an angle there to stop pooling. But yeah, everywhere I go, stored flat in the pissing down rain. Guys out there getting burnt. Guys can't work anymore because they're state of their hands. Absolutely disgusting. I invite you to come and sit with me in a podcast. Like I said, see you later.